We needed to locate Ryuichi Cooper, Master Ninja, and Master Chef. According to the Cooper clan history, Ryuichi Cooper was actually the inventor of sushi. After creating this delectable dish, he opened a sushi restaurant, which, while very prosperous, also provided the perfect cover for a ninja. When we got to Japan, it was obvious something was very wrong. What should have been a peaceful village was more like a heavily patrolled military base. We located Ryuichi Sushi Restaurant only to find it shut down and under guard. Things got worse when Bentley discovered that Ryuichi was locked up in a new high security jail, allegedly for serving bad sushi to the Shogun. It all sounded like a pretty tough piece of fish to swallow. We needed to get to the bottom of the situation, and the first order of business was getting Ryuichi out of prison. Sly Cooper and the gang in? Turning Japanese, I'm turning Japanese, I really think so. <laughs> I didn't even know it was called that, it just randomly came. Thiefnet has new goodies. Do you want to go to the Thiefnet? Uh, sure, let's go ahead and see what the Thiefnet float likes in this game. But anyways, guys, you're not a gamer here. Welcome back to some more Sly Cooper. We're going to get this paraglider because that is an awesome thing. Uh, we can't avo uh, afford anything else, but I'll be sure to make sure we get those. Uh, but welcome back to some more Sly Cooper Thieves in Time. Let's go ahead and start off with Sly. Of course he has a mission first. Every character has a Binocucom. Really now, I did not know that. Being grown up with Sly Cooper is one of my favorite PS2 classics. But uh, this game has really got the feel of the old one, which is great. Hopefully we'll have 100% on all of those. I will try my best to do so. So if you're looking forward to getting all those, then, well, pay attention. <laughs> but uh, this game is really great so far. So can't wait to actually get further into the adventure, but knowing that I've already played the demo, which, you know, the demo was uh, the last thing we did on part one. The only thing to really complain about is the loading screens are kind of long, as you can tell right now. But nothing too major to complain about. So we're in 1600s AD after death. So 30 clue bottles. That's going to be an iffy one, because, you know, the other ones I had them almost like memorized. This one is brand new. I've only seen a few game, a uh, few gameplay of each of them. But since I see something that's worth checking out. Let's come over here and start pickpocketing so we can get some more gold enough to actually acquire some better moves for the other gang. And we have Mahog... I'm... I don't know. One thing you're gonna learn about me if you're new, old viewers that have been Sly Cooper that have really started my channel, if you didn't know that, I don't really know if I said that in part one. Well, I, I am terrible at pronouncing things. I'm. That's one thing you're gonna get used to. Hopefully you get used to. <laughs> Okay, but yeah, Sly Cooper really, you know, shut off my channel. You know, I did Sly 1, and it was really fun and all, but then when I did Sly 2, something just hit, you know? A lot of viewers really liked it, and you know, I like to get known for some classics, you know? Oh, we get our first clue bottle in the game. Come on, give me a trophy for that. I always like trophies. You found a clue bottle. Collect all 30 hidden clue bottles in an episode to gain access to episode safe. But let's go ahead. Oh, yep. Just like the old Slice, we gotta take pictures first. Okay, Sly, we need to break Ryuichi out of jail. I have some ideas, but you know the drill. I need you to do some recon for me. Camera work? Correct a mundo, Monami. I need some shots of the prison entrance and the samurai armor those big guards are wearing. You should also grab some shots of Ryuichi's restaurant. We may need those for later. Capiche? Uh, yeah, I got you, pal. But maybe we should stick with English. Sayonara, cooper -san. I can't believe we made it out of Paris in one piece. Oh, the gang's a little bit rusty, so we gotta actually take several pictures, and we have a little mini-map to help us guide us. Let's go over here. Anything worth stealing? Can't. It looks like there is, but I can't really tell. I'm pretty sure that if I'm not... Crap, that's not good. Run, Sly! But um, they kept the feel of Sly 2, which most people are really excited for. Mainly because... Why did I just jump? I pressed circle. Um, a lot of people like Sly 2 the most. The storyline was amazing. The gra uh, 
game animation was great and the story like the game length was good as for slide 3 the length was pretty short and no bam that was snap okay we got four these guards look like real bruisers and real ugly too that was definitely not his best side all right so we got to take a second picture here and what do we got here all right, so we gotta get up there. It's the easiest way to get up there. Sorry for that little cut right there. But, uh, okay, apparently you can't jump on that tree. You go straight through it. That's, where's that even? Where's a good jumping place in? All right, we'll come from right here. Wasn't expecting to go th straight through a tree, but, you know. All right, let's get up here. All right, the jumping is kind of a little bit, a little bit different feel for that, but... You know, it's not that bad. Uh, it just, he doesn't feel like whenever you do the double jump, it's not as high. I really don't like the look of that place. Something tells me paraglide all the way over here. Worse. So yeah, I recommend oh, you go I ahead and get the paraglider, especially with getting these. It's pretty helpful. She'll never believe it. <laughs> Is that a clue? No, it's not a clue bottle. No. Now I'm used to inverted a little bit. Crap. Oh, we went ahead and changed it back to non-inverted, but we got the dragon gates. Well, Two more pictures to go. The largest gate I've ever seen. <laughs> the thief in me just needs to know what's behind it. Mm. All right. Trying to look for clue bottles as I wander around as well. First and ask questions later. No, there's no way I'm gonna be like, oh, I can. Sushi house. Mm, I love sushi. I'm actually not the biggest fan of sushi. Actually, no, I can't really say that. I've never had sushi. It just doesn't look appealing to me. It might be good for all I know. A lot of people seem to like it, though, and it's healthy, so... So be it. Oh, I've seen that ball before. It looks fun. This guy definitely looks out of place. <clears throat> With a big old cigar in his hand. Guy's ugly mug for Bentley. If I'm not mistaken, was it not the left analog stick you used to move around with the Binocucom in the other game and not the right one? Maybe I am. I'm pretty sure they didn't smoke Cuban cigars in ancient Japan. Oh yeah, I didn't think about that. Look my way. Why? I'm sure I recognize that guy. He's wanted by Interpol. He's a ruthless mercenary general responsible for overthrowing several small countries. So what kind of mess are we in, Bentley? I don't know, but one thing's certain. My hunch was correct. We are the only ones with a time machine. Well, I didn't see that coming. Job complete. Good job. But I did just see a clue bottle and I want to get it. Dimitri Lewis, I don't know, was a frustrated artist who turned to crime and joined the Claw Gang. In a strange twist of fate, he later became a val uh, valued, it looks like a V, valued ally of the Cooper Gang. In slide 3, actually. You can replay any job in the jobs van replay computer. Would you like to? No, I do not. All right, so let's go ahead and see what we got. Um, can we go to the thief net? Oh, we got to press triangle to go there. Okay. Uh, Kane during a combat press quickly press. Let's go ahead and get some of that. And let's go ahead and get some Maria. So we got a little bit for everybody, but we got three new ones we can actually get. All right. Maria's just sleeping. That's kind of weird, it has to go to a big loading screen for that, but... Because, you know, the other one, he just pops out of the door and just moves along. If it takes this long every time, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start cutting out loading screens, so you don't have to watch all of this, you know, flashing, unless I'm talking about something. Newly purchased items can be used by the gadget grid by holding down the L2 button. Alright. I'm pressing L2. Maybe he doesn't need it, but... 
cross save. Yeah, actually, you actually do. You actually do come with a PS Vita version too, which is cool. I don't actually have a PS Vita, but if I did, and I probably will eventually, you know, I'll definitely. It'll be cool to play Sly on the go. If it's a really good game, we'll find that out later. Let's go ahead and do Operation. Well, it's not really an Operation, but Breakout. Sly, this place is locked down tighter than, well, uh, tighter than something. Your database security, Murray's pants. Whatever, Sly, this is no laughing matter. I've checked, and there really is no way in except for the front entrance. I think there's only one option. The doorbell. Very funny. Now, you're going to need a disguise. Get yourself a suit of armor from those guards. That's our way in. Roger that. Just call me Samurai Sly. Ah, uh, that was clever. I didn't, I didn't see that. Cause that was a good one, Sly. Samurai Sly. So are we going to take it off their clothes? Or are we... What? What's going to happen here? I'm not really sure. The paraglide really just like comes out of thin air. I'm gonna pickpocket him first. Or maybe that's what I gotta do. We took off a piece. We took off his armor. Good job, Sly. You got the helmet. Why does he got a helmet strapped to his butt? That's random. But okay. Where's the next one? Oh, it shows me an arrow, so I don't have to actually see it. Is it like Skyrim? Or Zelda, where you take a chicken and everybody comes after you. Well, actually, the chickens come after you in Zelda. Just flat out, just you hit one of them. I used to do that all the time, and I freaked out when I was a kid, and that happened. No! Oh, it's kind of weird how it rewinds. It makes sense, though. Come over here. This should be a bounce pad. All right, good. Where are we at here? Oh, sorry. You're a bird, but. I guarantee you can't actually fly, so I'm gonna hit you off the edge. That's right. Alright. Where is it at? Oh, it's over there. I can barely see it. The music background's pretty awesome. Oh, he's asleep. That should be easier. Oh, crap. I thought I did that. Let's just take it. That's right. We got the armor chest piece. That's the chest plate. Now you just need the leggings. Leggings or greaves. Playing Monster Hunter too much. Which is also a great PSP game. If or actually it's a Wii game now, but it you know. PSP game it was amazing. I didn't play Monster Hunter 3 too much. I don't know if anybody ever did. But if if you're new to my channel, uh, I'm going to be let's playing like uh I've already done all three slides, but I'm going to be doing like uh what's it called? Like uh the finishing the Jack and Daxter series, I've already done part, I've already done the first one, the Precursor Legacy, but I'm going to be doing, you know, Jack 2 and Jack 3, and maybe even Jack X, even though it's not in the collection pack. Then some Ratchet and Clank, and then I like the game called Tata Tasmanian and Tiger, and I Ninja. Those are going to be the major PS2 games I'm doing, oh, and Kingdom Hearts. So, if you want to stick around for any of those, that'd be great, you know. Always enjoy a new viewer to come along with this adventure. There's two clue balls right there, isn't there? Oh, there's only one. I'll take it. Whoops. Alright. And okay, so that's only three. And I really haven't seen any others. There's another one though. Crap. I'm going for it. As long as I can steal this guy's. Oh, I won't be able to with him coming after me, so I gotta get out of here. He stopped looking for me. Alright, don't wake up, go back to sleep, I just need your leggings. So we got this samurai leggings, we got the full place of armor. Just like in slide 3 when you disguise yourself. Why is the chill doing this? Excellent slide, you got the complete suit of armor! <laughs> just how he walks. Slide, you need to use the samurai armor to blend in with the guards. As long as you're wearing it, they'll think you're one of them. Press the L2 button to change into the armor. Press the L2 button again to take it off. And don't forget, you won't be able to use your normal moves while in disguise. So where am I looking Thanks, for? Time to try this. Oh yeah, it's up there again. Prison door. 
Let's go ahead and check out this prison. And meet Ryuchi. If I even said that right. Oh, I'm like a commanding officer. You there, open the door. A little short to be a commander, aren't you? Who are you? Why, I am Major Mugshot. Huh? Mugshot? I've never heard of you. Ha! You dare question me? Son, I've been a guard since you were just a squealing piglet. Wait until I tell the general about this. I hear he loves pork chops. Wait, I'm very sorry, sir. I didn't recognize you. Please, go right in. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. In the next part, we're going to try to free Ryuichi Cooper from his jail cell and see what we can do there. Uh, so thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next part. Subscribe if you enjoyed and check out past Let's Plays of Sly if you want to as well. Uh, Being on a gamer here, guys. I'll see you guys next time.